Hi, honey. How's your day going so far? Mine is going fine. Okay, today I'll be doing an unboxing. And the actual demo comes on another video. Doing an unboxing of Mainstay's Personal Blender. Because I want some some quick smoothies and I don't always want to pull out my big expensive Blendtec blender and I don't always want to pull out my big juicer so I wanted something small that can sit on the counter because if it's out I'm more likely to use it if it's sitting out where it's readily accessible so let's get to this unboxing. So like it says mainstays. I don't know why you put this tag right on the, the name. What does it say anyway? I'm thinking it was under $10. I'm not sure what I paid for it. But anyway, it has a one year warranty and I don't have my receipt. Uh, it says easy one touch blending operation. Let me read this other side. Liquidoro Functuolo Amiento Facel de Liquido Con Usolo Talk Conveniente Taza Para Viaja E Liqua de Fitting Anses Limpiado Rapido De La Taza E Tapa Aptos Para Lava Healers. Woo! My mouth got to work out. Easy one touch blending operation. Convenient 15 ounce blend and go travel cup. Fast, fast cleanup with dishwasher, safe cup, and lid. 220 watt motor. That's what it looks like. So. And I read the instruction booklet last night. So it has instructions. I guess that's Spanish and English on the other side. So I read it. This is the... Smells like plastic. This is the plastic lid. This is the blender bottle. 15 ounce travel cup. And the blender, what you call it? Well, this is where the blades are in this bottom part. So I'm going to wash this before I use it. Those four blades, and they look real, real sharp. So they said this is 15 ounces. Here's the base. It says skid resistant rubber feet. We're going to see. It does. Three skid resistant rubber feet on the bottom. The motor's in this part. So, of course, you don't put this part in your, uh, you don't wash this. You don't put this in any water. It has, look at it. Half scissors after all. Uh, have to cut this off. It has one polarized blade. One blade is 
uh, wider than the other one. And looks like a four foot cord. It's plenty long enough, well, at least for my counter. And this is how it works. You put your fruits, your ice, vegetables, and your liquid in this cup. And it has a max line right here. You don't fill the liquid up further than the max line, but you can fill it up with fruits and vegetables and stuff higher than this max line. And then just smash it down. But just make sure you have enough liquid in here so it will blend. So I can't wait to use it. Most people use um, almond milk. So I don't have any of that. Oh, we got little guides on here. So you can put it in here right. Got little guides. Should have had three. Oh, it does have three. Okay, fits in there nice, nicely. And then to use it, there's no buttons on here to push anywhere. You just Supposed to just turn it. Well, it ain't plugged in, ain't nothing in here. I'm trying to see if I can turn it. Well, they say don't use it if nothing is in here, so it's not even letting me turn it. You turn it one way for it to blend up your slush or smoothie or whatever, and then to stop it, you just turn it the other way. That's very easy. So I hope it really works. And like I said, it's a personal size. So if it works nicely, then I'm gonna see about getting another one of these. So I can have Walter's stuff ready in here and then he can just put it in here and he can blend up his own stuff. Cause he's not always ready to eat or drink when I'm ready, so. It feels pretty nice. I hope it works. I looked at the reviews and there are mixed reviews. Some don't like it and other people love it. So we're gonna see. And like I said, I think it was under $10, but I ain't really sure. I don't know why it was so cheap. And it has a little fan down here. I guess that's to keep the, the motor cool when you're blending up stuff. A little fan. Okay, so that's the extent, extent of my mainstays personal blender unboxing. And I will do the demo another day in another video. Okay, I want to thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up, leave a nice comment, and subscribe to my channel. And you all have a very blessed rest of the day. Okay, I'm about to get in there and make some chicken dogs. Okay, bye. <laughs>